My mom told me this. Hate has four letters, but so does love. Enemies has seven letters, but so does friends. Lying has five letters, but so does truth. Failure has seven letters, but so does success. Cry has three letters, but so does joy. And negativity has 10 letters, but so does positivity. You always have a choice, so choose the better side of it. I don't know what your future is, but if you are willing to take the harder way, the more complicated one, the one with more failures at first than successes, the one that has ultimately proven to have more meaning, more victory, more glory, then you will not regret it. The life that you have is a life that you chose. Where you're currently living, what you're currently doing, you chose that. People complain about having kids, people complain about having responsibilities, people complain about their rent, people complain about their student loans. Most of these things in life are self-imposed. You self-impose a lot of these issues in your life. That's just the nature of the, of the game. So when you understand that everything is self-imposed, then you're like, okay, I'm gonna be a little bit more relaxed on my responsibilities, I'm gonna be, more careful about the decisions and the commitments that I make because I understand that there's long-term consequences to it. I see a lot of people complaining, dude, but very few people taking action. Most people make excuses. Very few people make moves. Two things we get every day. That's a chance and a choice. Let's put more value on the choices that we make because our choices are what determine our destination. Put more value on your choices because that's everything. Put an individual in a frame of mind. Every choice you make, evaluate it. Kind of think about it. Life becomes so much sweeter just, just doing that.